Like, so first of all, has the scene been hurt by city pages going down? Like, has like the scene you, you know, been hurt by city pages? Yeah, yeah. Because uh, you know, I don't know. Like for comedy, where I come from, mm-hmm. it hurts because we can't promote our shows that well. There's no mm-hmm. great place to do it. So we mm-hmm. should probably invite artists to do that here. By the way. Oh yeah, no, for sure. But uh, to answer your question, yeah, City Pages was fucking terrible for hip hop. It was terrible <laughs> yeah. for music. Like that, there's no question about that. Because terrible. There is a senior editor at the top of every production that you know of. Every newspaper, every magazine, there's a senior editor. That senior editor at C- at City Pages was letting the most bullshit fly, and Man. they were all personal opinion pieces. Basically. You, the the city pages was starting to look like the onion when it comes to music. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, like yeah. there's they wouldn't even promote anything that was good, but anything that negative that came up, them niggas was about printing that shit. That's why city pages went down because a lot they would start letting all these young writers get in with opinion pieces that were not even relevant because these were people that stay in their fucking apartment 24 hours of the day and ain't never been outside. <laughs> ain't never been in the streets around any of these Facts. any of these people that make this music or Facts. conduct the, the, you know what I'm saying, that conduct the train that, that runs the culture. You know what I'm saying? They ain't never been around it, but they go to one show and they got this big ass opinion and then they say something in the city pages. You know what I'm saying? That was not cool, and At I'm all. I I I do I do feel bad for anybody who did benefit off of city pages but as far as music goes they were a detrimental piece to it because the only positive i ever saw was about pos or anybody related to rhyme sayers yeah that's and facts. there was there's so much other music and so much uh, so many other things going on and they pretty much ignored it unless it was negative you feel facts. me so yeah no i i definitely I'm, I'm that, almost thankful that City Pages was shut down because the narratives that they spewed out were, were, were remind you of the Republican president right. that we had before. <laughs> I thought <laughs> Dessa owned it at a certain point. She was on the cover every like. I thought that Dessa owned City Pages. She was See? on the cover every fucking three months. You would you would think that the writers at City Pages only knew about white artists in Minnesota. There and was no crazy. such thing as black artists or any artist of color at City Pages. And if City Pages or anybody that previously wrote for City Pages feels differently, please write us. I, I encourage you because I will shut you down. And 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 just you know, exact same for com 